yeah, the early 20s were easily the worst part of my life. When I got out of school, I, I was a straight A student coming out of school thinking, I got good grades. I, everything is just going to fall into place. And then I fell flat on my face in life, in careers. And I had like no future. <laughs> and that was terrible. That was a really dark time of me working dead end jobs to make payments on a car that I bought specifically for a job that I got let go from the week after I bought the car. <laughs> Level 40 sounds bad. <laughs> Uh, it was, yeah, it was a rough time and I, I hung around in the radio industry in a, 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 a particular job that wasn't my passion. And I worked, I continued to work as a stock boy at a pharmacy. And I also worked, thankfully, you know, shout outs to my mom for hooking me up at a job at her, at her place that did like international taxes and i worked with randy as like a data entry clerk and my job was here's the invoice i i look at it i type the numbers into the spreadsheet and then i put the invoice from one stack to another stack and then i get the next invoice and i type it again and it's about 10 seconds per sheet and i did that you know eight hours a day for however many days a week i worked and it was a really sad, miserable time doing that work because that was just not, not what I wanted out of a career. And uh, during that time, stop reading my Wikipedia bio. <laughs> it was kind of a turning point for me too, because like I, I had a, I had an MP3 player that had I don't know five hundred, maybe a gig of space and so not a lot of music on there and we didn't have streaming at the time and i burned through my playlist really quick and i noticed when randy was working he would be listen it would be talking and it would he would laugh and i was like what are you listening to and he was like oh podcasts and i ended up downloading a couple and that ended up becoming my thing where I would just download all the video game podcasts, uh, other stuff like how stuff works. And it was stuff like, you know, player one podcast, giant bomb, one up yours. And just that one, it was a way for me to, you know, get through this, this miserable job. But then also it opened my eyes to a different way of content creation around games, having it be a little more conversational and more personal and, that is very much a major influence to why I started the in third person blog and ultimately this stream here kind of born out of me working as a data entry clerk hating my life. So even that's not all bad.